Hey there, this is uh, Josh Burns, and I'm here to do my video on the book I read this week, and it is titled, um, Oh No, Where Are My Pants? And the author is uh, Lee Bennett Hopkins, and the uh, published date was in 2005. I picked this book because, you know, I thought it was just a, a really good children's book overall. Uh, it, it's a book of all these different uh, poems and, and just poetry in general that uh, it just goes over all different aspects. Uh, there was a couple of the poems, you know, that kind of stood out to me in there. Um, one was about a, you know, a kid that was in his class and the teacher was asking questions and she wanted to know what the capital of Florida was. And he was so sure of himself that he he stated that he threw his hand up so fast he almost you know threw his elbow or his shoulder all smooth out of socket and she asked him what the capital of florida was and his answer was tassaluma and he thought he was saying tallahassee he knew you know what the capital was but he just didn't really know how to pronounce it i guess you could say but of course, in turn, you know, the whole class turned it around on him and kind of made fun of him about it. So he kind of got down on himself. And there was another little poem in there that caught my attention. And it was a, uh, it was called uh, Away at Camp, you know, and it was about a kid that was gone to camp. And, and uh, she, she was just, uh, or he, I, I don't remember if it was a boy or a girl, but they were just sad, you know, because they were so far away from home. And it just, you know, they just realize, you know, how much they really miss home, the little stuff you take for granted. I mean, that kind of thing, I feel like it's good for kids to see and read about. You know, I, I thought it was a good children's book because, you know, the all the different poems, they kind of just sh show the kids all the different uh, problems or, uh, or just things, you know, they may experience in their life. Uh, I would definitely say that using this uh, poetry book in my classroom would be very good just because it you know it goes through so many different aspects of poetry in general there's funny poems and there's sad poems and you know a lot of them are about kids just having a bad day and you know kids have that so you know I, like i said i would definitely use it in my classroom you know because you could just tell a kid as a, as a lesson you know you could have all these kids read the poems out loud and as a teacher you know hey assign each kid to pick their worst day and write a poem about it and you know use their emotions in words and just kind of let them express themselves but you know overall i thought it was a good book thank you